In this video, we will use the TI Inspire CX cost to calculate sample variance, sample standard deviation, population variance, and population standard deviation. And just to get started, we need to understand that sample represents a portion of a large set of data, kind of like a survey of a million people in a town. It would be too difficult to survey each person, so you just take a sample of maybe a hundred people to represent a million while population represent the whole thing. Say if you want to survey your five friends, you would be able to actually survey each and every one of them. With that in mind, we will calculate a few things. With that in mind, we have two problems. Your five friends' ages are 10, 15, 14, 12, and 18. We want to determine the variance and standard deviation using the TI Inspire CX cost. So to get started, we need to get the list. So we hit Control, this icon right here, and we copy the numbers 10 comma 15 comma 14 comma 12 comma 18 hit enter next we hit menu we go to statistics we go to list math and in this case it's a population variance so we need to go to a population variance then we can do control answer hit enter and let's say we want a decimal. If we do control enter, we get 7.36. Next, let's calculate the standard deviation for this population. So we hit menu, we go to statistics, we go to list math, then we go to population standard deviation. Um, we could go up, hit enter, then do control enter. So the standard deviation for this population is 2.71293. Next, we'll do a second problem. Five random people are selected from the mall to understand the demographic of its customers. So in this case, it's going to be a sample variance and sample standard deviation. So let's do this. So we go to menu, we go to statistics, we go to list math, then we go to sample variance, eight. We go up for our list, hit enter, then we do control enter, we get 9.2. This is the sample variance. Now we want to calculate the sample standard deviation. So menu, we go to statistics, we go to list math, then we go to sample standard deviation. Here, seven. Then we go up, hit enter, hit control, enter. This right here is the sample standard deviation. And that is how we can calculate sample variance, sample standard deviation, population variance, and population standard deviation using the TI Inspire CS costs.